going to make a coffee i already have it like in the freezer down here so i'm going to add um some milk and creamer um i have tryouts today it's going to be like completely separate because i'm filming a tryouts um video that's going to be like pretty long so um whew. so if you want to see like the full thing that will probably be up gosh not until like june 10th 15th something like that because our finals are june 4th and then it takes like a week to get our results back but um yeah we have tryouts today but tomorrow is mine and trevor's four year anniversary so we're gonna go out to dinner and i'll show you guys like my outfit and everything for that but um then this weekend is the bachelorette party for the those shirts i just showed you and i need to wash megan's shirt there's like a weird stain on it and i don't know if it was already there or what happened but we did get a washer and dryer this weekend, so, yeah, okay. I also need to edit and work, so I'm gonna make my coffee and then get working. These are the products that I've been using. The regular soy milk, for some reason, I've been liking better than the vanilla soy milk. And then just the vanilla soy creamer have been my two products. Got my coffee. I'm just gonna, I was gonna sit on the porch, but I'm not going to. Um, I do wanna show you guys the front porch furniture. I don't think I've ever shown that. Um, Okay, here's the front porch furniture. I've literally never shown it. Um, these little chairs are super cute. They're just like, you guys can't even see them, can you? They're just like brown and black. And then I got these outdoor pillows from Walmart, actually. Super cute. And then this is the little table. You can't see a thing. I'm gonna have to show you guys this later. Pretend I just like didn't do that. But I am going to open up the curtains. Guys, I am back. It is literally midnight. I ate dinner, kind of wrapped everything up, packed stuff for work. I was going to shower, scrub, shave, and tan tonight. Not happening. I can tell you that. I'm tired and I'm just not in the mood. So I'm going to like shower because I'm covered in tanologists and that would get all over the bed maybe i don't know um put my hair in a bun and we're gonna wash it in the morning because i want hair my hair to be fresh all day tomorrow rather than like me sleeping on it so i'm gonna wash it before i go to work in the morning um tomorrow is mine and trevor's four-year anniversary and so i'm gonna have like super fresh hair when we got to dinner and i'm not gonna be tan but i'm just gonna use tanologist and then i will um shower shave and tan tomorrow night um leading into hopefully um practice for finals on thursday so i'll be tan for that but honestly i'm just not feeling doing all that tonight and trevor's downstairs asleep i literally like woke him up like five different times to tell him i was going up but he's like dead asleep so plan is once i'm showered i'll actually drag him up to bed but I don't really care right now because I'm gonna shower but my makeup and everything lasted really well I got a bunch of compliments on my hair today so shout out to Q um but I'm just gonna hang back up this dress because I literally wore it in put my bra away put all this away and get a little shower and get ready for bed and I'm so excited to lay in bed I'm so happy that trial's over it's so nerve-wracking you guys like there were close to 90 of us and you go in alphabetical order so winter who was on my team last year with me she was a rookie with me winter is the last person to go and so the poor girl sits there for like two and a half hours stressed or like my name starts with a c so i'm like pretty early and i literally like wait maybe like 30 minutes and then it's my turn and then after that you can literally chill and it's the best feeling ever also, update, 
I got this pillow, um, the leather one I didn't love up here, so I moved that leather one down to the um, living room, and then I'm going to return the other leather one, but this one I saw on TikTok, um, it's like this, also you guys know that these are like fur, so like that's why they look weird right now, like you can move them, but um, yeah, this girl on TikTok, she does like a bunch of like remodel type things and she uses a lot of target items and this is just a big studio mcgee pillow um the lighting isn't as good but it literally looks so good with these pillows and it was on sale it was 20 percent off and when i clicked all the links from the bed that or the bedroom that she remodeled and like literally everything was target and knew this was target i literally got on and my newport target or like my target had it so I'm so excited and it just like looks better. These lamps are still going. I'm just waiting on the hardware for the new lamps. New lamps are literally in that closet. So I just like that those pillows so much better, but I literally don't like my lamps. So I'm excited just to have all white lamps. And I just feel like the browns just tie together better. Good morning guys. I didn't vlog um, whenever I go into work. I mean, I could go in the spare bedroom and show you guys my outfit in, like, the Lululemon mirror, but Trevor is sleeping, so, yeah. Um, I was going to wear a dress today, the one I wore to Megan shower, because I don't really have many options at home still. Like, I have a lot of my work top options, not, like, my super springy tops. Those are hanging in my closet at my parents, and same with um, my work pants are all at my parents. So, we're going very casual, very, like boring to work today I have on this like I don't even know what this linen-y like I don't even know what the material is but it's like a little Henley and it goes pretty far down obviously I have a button almost the top and it has like a just like a normal tight cuff but it's like super long I think this is a small or an extra small it was all they had in stock at TJ Maxx but super long covers my butt which I really like and then I'm wearing black straight leg jeans from the gap they're like they're like they're slim straight so like they're skinny jeans but they're not like skinny at the ankles I don't really know how to say that I had a really hard time waking up this morning I just felt like I got hit by a bus so yes I was gonna wake up and wash my hair clearly did not do that um, I may wash my hair when I get home before we go out to dinner um, but I may not so we'll see from work I just ate a whole little like tub of the rest of our tub of grapes it's a gross rainy day out but we're going to a an Italian restaurant for our anniversary I have no makeup on right now so I'm gonna throw some on throw on some tanologist and a little outfit and I will show you guys what I end up wearing because I honestly don't really know what I'm gonna go with um, I have an idea but I don't know. Um, I ate some plantain chips and some grapes when I got home because I was so hungry. And then, um, if you know me, you know I love crumble. And I pre ordered crumble. So. But it's really raining out. I'll show you guys. Can you guys tell how bad it's raining? You can't, but it's raining pretty hard. And so, I don't know. That's kind of sad. Alright, fit check for anniversary dinner. Um, I decided to stick with the blazer look. I was going to wear like a crop top, like little short sleeve thing, but it's, the temperature dropped a bunch. It's 64 and it's rainy. So, we're doing just our Zara blazer, little um, black tank dress, just from Lululemon. Um... It's an all yours tank dress, diamond necklace, gold hoops. This bag I feel like looks good because the black straps. And then I went with white platform, high top, leather, converse, and black frilly socks. So that's the fit. We're going to go to dinner. And I'm so excited. We're going to a little Italian restaurant. And we're going to get crumble after. Surprise us having that macadamia nut tonight. Good? 
of all the icing, I feel like those just don't keep well. You know? Yeah. Um, I need water. I need napkin. Do you see if you have a napkin for me? We that up too loud when we were trying. Probably. Do you see if you have a napkin for me? I do. You put them in here. Are you going to? Yeah. We went to dinner. We got no clips. I would have vlogged dinner, but we were at the bar. When you're at the bar, you have no privacy. And, and like, they're always, like, coming up because they're, like, working at the bar and asking if you need help. Um, and want more drinks and stuff, so I just felt like it was a little weird to vlog. But if you follow me on Instagram, you saw a few little things. Did you get a picture of your food? No. So. Anyway. Now my messing up today. Messing up. Now my hands are sticky. And we're going to go. I'll probably have another bite of each cookie and then be done. Because tryouts tomorrow, baby. It is... Friday morning, I took off today. Um, I knew I would need to, and I was right. I literally have not packed a single thing. I need a tan, if you can tell. The lighting is really bad, I don't really know what to do. I need to tan. Um, I forgot to pick up my Target order last night because there were such severe thunderstorms that I like sat at Paul Brown for so long. Um, so I'm going to pick up my Target order really quick. I'm just going to do a drive up order. Um, and then I might run by um, UPS and drop off a package. And then we're going to head to my parents' house to pick up a few things and then head back home. Um, I haven't had coffee yet. I don't know. Sometimes I love coffee. Um, when I'm going on errands, like running errands, but sometimes I'm like, I just want to like enjoy it and not allow it to get like super watered down. So to think about what I wanted to do, um, Monmouth coffee sounds really good, but that will take like a little extra time. I don't know why I keep calling it Monmouth coffee. Like that's the name. That's not the name. It's called Baker's Table Bakery. Their coffee is really good. Um, but at this point, like, I'm just trying to, like, get going. Um, I need to leave my house by, like, 1.15 at the latest. I'm trying to tell myself 1.10. Very sore from practice last night. Um, we learned literally an entire routine. Luckily, I knew the routine. Because I went to a prep class. One of those recommendations that I will always say, go to prep classes. Especially if you're trying out with Bengals or the Bengals. Like, we reuse those. Um, so I knew my dance. I just had to like kind of go over it more, but yeah, it was fun. And we had a showcase and everything. So it was a little more nerve wracking than like the first regular tryout day that we had last year. Um, we didn't do all that. That day is going to be more like next Tuesday. So yeah. My Amazon returns just picked up my target order and now we're going to head home or it's my parents first. Sorry. You guys, I'm trying out this like cookie coffee. I've like, I like trying new coffees on my vlog so that you guys can see what I'm trying. So it's, you get an ice shake and espresso, change the espresso to blonde. Um, I'm getting a venti, but you can choose whatever. So I think normally you would do like less, I did less pumps. So a venti comes with like five pumps, but I'm just doing two pumps of vanilla. You can do sugar free, I don't like sugar free. That's what makes it healthier, but whatever. Um, two pumps of brown sugar and then a scoop of vanilla bean powder. Yum. And I got extra ice and soy milk. So we're going to try it out. And then Trevor, I just got him an ice caramel macchiato, grande, extra ice, soy, and a venti cup. And yeah, we're going to check out and get the coffees. So I just placed the order. All right, we are here. You can't really tell. But we are. And I'm going to run in and grab coffee. Okay. Let's try it. This is Trevor's. Mine already stirred up and everything. I have not tried it yet. 
Um, I feel like I might have needed an, because the girl got a grande with this scoop of vanilla bean powder. I probably should have got two scoops since I got a venti, but it's okay. Let's try it. It's good. It's really good. It's just really strong. But that was also me trying not to have like 12 pounds of syrup and stuff. So like look how confusing my sticker is. Like they probably hated me when they saw that. But it's good. I may add more soy milk when I get home. But I really enjoy that. So we're going to head home. And... Yeah, start packing. Okay, good morning everybody. It is Thursday. Trevor is going out of town this weekend. Um, so I'm gonna do some like fun things, probably with my mom this weekend. Um, I'm gonna get my toes done. I doubt I'm gonna be able to get those done because our nail place is so busy on the weekends. So I may save that for sometime next week, but I really would like to get them done. I honestly may go today. I don't know. But I'm going to get my nails done next week. Um, next week is finals. So this week we have tryouts. The last... So we have, gosh, three more regular finals practices. And then we learn... Um, and then we have a, like, walkthrough for, like, the finals thing. I don't know. It's whatever. But I want to do a little weekend in my life. It is Thursday. Tomorrow I'm going into the office. And just going to do some fun things with my mom. I also have a wedding shower this weekend. So Trevor and I went and got coffee since he's going out of town today. Um, we just got, I got Baker's Table Bakery um, coffee and then he got Starbucks. We happened to see my mom at Starbucks. That was kind of funny. Um, just in some t-shirt and some Lululemon shorts. A little crazy. I ordered the new like tan cute belt bag crossbody thing from Lululemon that's coming in today but I accidentally ordered it to my parents house so I'll show you guys that because I'll see my mom this weekend and I'll probably take it as my little bag um this weekend it's Memorial Day weekend so I'm off Monday and we're doing some stuff so I'll probably carry this vlog in to Monday and then um I'm really excited because I'm filming oh I'm filming a like little like prep for like NFL finals TikTok. That'll be fun. You guys will see that. Make sure to follow me on TikTok. Um, I think I always have it linked. If I don't, I will put it in. And this is me telling future Kryn, editing Kryn, to put it in. But I'm working. There's my work computer. I need to do like a bunch of stuff today. And then it's really gross and rainy out. And so I don't think I'm going to go to a lunch cycle. I think I'm going to do a lunch mirror workout. And I have practice tonight. I keep calling it practice because it feels like practice, but it's technically tryouts. Like, there's a bunch of us there. There's like 60 of us, obviously. Like, 30 of us will make the team. So, yeah. Already for practice, um, I'm just going to head there. It's kind of like a rainy, gloomy, gross day. And so, I don't know. We're just going to head to practice. And I'll probably just see you guys after because I told you guys I'm going to show you guys me like making dinner and stuff. I need to put some ice in my water and yeah, I had just have um, my tote bag and then my little outfit on. This is what I decided to wear. So this is the long sleeve, but I have on this cute sports bra on top and then I curled my hair. So my hair is ready to be washed i'm washing it tonight so i'm very excited about that because it needs a good old wash hey guys heading home we got out a little early we got out at eight o'clock instead of nine but of course like it is now nine o'clock because i chilled at home or chilled at home huh chilled around took some pics with some friends talked to them whatever so now it is like almost nine o'clock but it's a little bright out so i'm excited about that so plan is to go home and make a little mexican dish i'm really excited and just chill for the night um dallas cowboys she looks making the team has literally been on all day so i'm going to turn that on while i'm making food um i think i'm just going to do microwave rice with some beans and then add in some seasoning i'll probably
probably do some chicken on the skillet. We have this like creamy jalapeno and then we have some avocado and then I'm gonna put it on some little wraps. So I'm so excited, it just sounds so good. I'm gonna do a zevia, we're gonna go all out. We have no chips or anything for the side, but I thought about getting Chipotle, but we're tomorrow's Friday, obviously, so I'm like, okay, on the weekends, especially when I'm with my mom, like if we're out shopping and doing things, like I'm always getting Chipotle with her, so I'd rather not ruin that um, and get Chipotle today. So, because normally, like, so I'm thinking about asking her to get lunch tomorrow, depending on what day I leave or what time I leave work, um, or like, Saturday, probably not, because I'm gonna be out of shower till three o'clock. Sunday, we could get Chipotle or anything, so I'm kind of like holding off on my Chipotle. So we have the beans and rice mixture. I put some seasoning on it, some little chickens. I'm gonna cut up this avocado, and then I'm gonna get out the sauce and the tortillas, and then a zevia, and I'm so excited. We just have these, um, guys, these are the best bowls. They have this like grippy part, and they all come with lids, but so they don't like move around on you. I'm gonna have to link them, because they're amazing. They'll be in my house tour, but I'm gonna fill this up with water so I can finish or drink more water to hydrate more before I drink a sepia later. I did two carb balance wraps. These are what they look like. They're like 35 calories, which is nice. So I feel like I, when I eat these, like I always just like, if I do a regular one, I like eat all my calories in those, but smashed avocado on the bottom, the beans and rice mixture, the chicken. I did four strips on each and then some of this plant-based cauliflower creamy jalapeno, like cilantro jalapeno stuff. So good, I may make another because I have a plenty of ingredients, but I wanted to see where I stand after this and then I have an amazing dessert that I made a few nights ago and I have to show you guys because it's so good and Trevor and I have been like obsessed with it. Okay, I made a third. I was starving and I wanted to show you guys that I made a third and I'm eating a third. Good morning, everybody. It is oh, the next morning after practice or tryouts. Gosh, I keep calling it practice. It is tryouts. Literally, there are 60 something of us and there are girls vying for spots. It is tryouts. Anyway, I am headed to work um, today. I would have gone in on um, like Thursday or Monday or something, but today we have a department meeting and it's in person so I have to come in and at that point like whatever um, I'm thinking about leaving at noon though and finishing the day at home because both of my meetings are in the morning and one of them is like my performance review so evaluation review thing which is like a big deal but it's over at I think it's over at 11 30 so I'm thinking about just leaving and then going and meeting my mom for lunch because we've been wanting to get lunch for like the past few weeks since I moved out and we just haven't been able to make it happen. So I think we're gonna go get lunch. Okay, so I am, you guys know me with my like flower obsession now that I have my cute little white roses. I actually don't even know if I've, shown them so i'm acting like you guys know you may not but i got white roses from um oh gosh trader joe's mother's day weekend and they're still looking pretty good but like they're starting to get a little weird so one of my friends from college actually just posted a story and they had pink peonies at trader joe's and you guys Peonies are my favorite flower. They've been my favorite flower forever. I used to have fake pink peonies in my room. Um, I always get like everything peony. Um, and Trevor got me peonies one time for like a birthday or whatever. Like I just love peonies and I like real peonies better because they're more like light pink rather than like vibrant like when I got the fake ones. So I was gonna get more white roses, but now I'm like, no. I'm gonna get pink roses, or pink roses, pink peonies, unless there's like not many peonies that look good. I may do one of each, but I wanna do two bouquets instead of one. Um, and then, yeah. You guys, nails are done. I got one coat of Funny Bunny and then two coats of Bubble Bath. 
almond shape nails. I love them. So, so good. I am going to make like a small latte and then head to my parents. I just changed out of work clothes. Um, I have on this little crop. I think it's like an LA crop from Lululemon. Got it forever ago. It's like very cropped. It's like literally here's my bra. It's very cropped. And then I love wearing my obsidian aligns with um, this. And then I just have on rainbows as of now. I may put on like sneakers or something. Um, and then I just have on everyday jewelry. My hair is in a clip right now just because it's been down all day and I'm kind of over it. But like I'll put it down. And then I'm going to do my new belt bag um, when I get home. I literally just grabbed my mama's hand sanitizer at home so or at her house. So I'm going to grab a hand sanitizer from her. But I just literally have my little wallet and then Laneige and my phone um, for my belt bag and then I have some of Megan's gifts and my mom's gonna help me wrap them so I'm gonna grab all of them and then I also have this cup that I need to take downstairs so we're just gonna head downstairs I'm gonna sit on the couch for a little bit make a small latte and then I'm gonna head to my parents so I'm not going over just yet but I did want to get super comfy just so I could leave when I'm ready to go Okay, so I decided to make a small little latte. This is just a single shot. I was kind of getting sleepy, so just went ahead, made one of those. I do want to show you guys the updates to our fridge. Our fridge is not perfect in here. Like, we have still water bottles because our water hasn't gotten set up, things like that. But I want to show you guys pretty much just these containers. So I got these containers. They are um, these, like, stackable ones. And so we have, like, fruit down here and then potatoes up here like mangoes and stuff and they're really great you can easily take them out but they stack really well and then this guy so I've been normally just putting the Zevia box in there um I love this little soda dispenser kind of thing obviously you don't have to use it for just Zevia but I would highly recommend looking at home goods this was seven bucks and I think it was like 20 at Target so these were like 4.99 each and then these are my favorite glass Tupperwares and then stainless steel bowls with a rubber bottom and they all come with lids best thing ever so love these they're so good so easy and they just like make everything just very organized which i love um i'm gonna go ahead and enjoy this coffee i just saw on rachel's story that she said oh wait i wanted to show you guys look at my cute little peonies look how cute you guys i think i'm gonna pull them down but for now they're up here um i may put them on the dining room table but um oh and then i'll show you guys i also picked up some eucalyptus here is the real eucalyptus from home goods 3.99 for that whole big bunch so cute and then this is megan's gift so i have it all in one package um I can show you guys really quick what I got Megan um, if you guys need like little ideas um, I am a bridesmaid and so I've literally already of course like as a bridesmaid you go to all the showers get them gifts and then like you know got her gift at like the bachelorette then I'm getting her a wedding gift so my the shower gifts don't don't need to be super elaborate but I do want them to be kind of meaningful so I'll show you guys really quick all of this stuff i kind of made it like a little care package don't mind my wallet and stuff in here that's not going to hurt clearly okay camera's chilling on a lamp so first thing this is like the main part of the gift is this candle from kindred file fires i will link their etsy shop on or down below super super cute so you get first off you get some little matches that say light for a spark of joy like how cute is that adorable and then here is the candle so it just says kindred fires like i think it's so cute look how cute obsessed um so i got the engagement candle because it's a shower and they're not married yet so i didn't want to get the mary like a married candle um, but it's so cute. I got her the 
I don't even remember what scent, but it smells really good. So it's this like cream candle. Then close up, I don't know if you guys can see this, how cute, it just says, Megan and CJ engaged. It has the date and where they got engaged. And then this is like, supposed to be like what the sky looked like when they got engaged, which is really cool. And then um, when you light the candle, which will be super, super cool, the like, this is see-through. So you'll see the flame, like the light sh kind of shining through, which will be really cool. And I just think it's a really pretty candle. So once you're done with it, you can use just this candle in general, which I think is so, so cute. They got engaged on November 6th of last year and it smells really good. She's a huge candle person, but this is like, so if somebody is like obsessed with candles, this is like, so cute and it's also just cute decor like i think it's adorable so i wanted to stick with the candle theme um so i thought about two of the candle things that i love and one is the um rechargeable little thing i don't know if i want to open hers i don't really want to open hers i actually have the exact same one so i'll go grab mine but it is a rechargeable um lighter it's the best thing ever i got her rose gold just like mine my mom got it for me for christmas and i've been using it all like since december you it just has a usb port and you just recharge it you never have to buy stupid lighters ever again it's so so good let me grab mine really quick so it's actually it's more of a champagne color, but this is what it looks like. It's like champagne and black. And um, so over here is where the rechargeable or the USB pulls out. So it's just USB. Sorry, the camera's not focusing. But then here, you just push this up. Can it focus, please? Or I don't really care. You push it up and then it has a spark. That's how you light the candle. And it's cute and it's like slim it's not all ugly and then i also got her a wick cutter so if you guys don't know i have a bunch of not a bunch i have two black wick cutters i got her a gold wick cutter to go along with it it's really important to cut your wicks um the tops off after they've been lit because they're like black and then if you relight it then it gets like the black all around the rim and I don't want that to happen to her cute little candle. So I got her a little gold wick cutter to go with the candle. And then I was like, looked at her registry just to see if I could find something like simple. Um, and she had wood beads on her registry. So I just purchased the exact ones that were on her registry. And that'll kind of, I got a cute box and I'll like put the wood beads around everything. Um, obviously none of the candle stuff was on her registry, but you don't know you need an electric lighter until you have one and you don't know you need a wick cutter until you have one. So I thought that went really well with the candle. And then I like that I got her beads because they're on her registry. They're cute, whatever. I love my wood beads. I have like three sets of wood beads around the house. So that's what I picked up for Megan and I'm going to be getting that to her tomorrow. And I might show you guys the like final look. Um, I got the cutest little box. It's like a light sage box with um, white florals on it. And then my mom has gold ribbon. So she's gonna help me tie a good gold bow. Cause she's really good at that. Also better lighting for my nails. So freaking cute, I'm obsessed. Okay, I'm gonna package this up. Um, and chill for a little bit longer, see what time my mom wants to leave, and then we'll figure all of that out. You guys have probably already seen this belt bag. It's literally called the crossbody. What is it called, actually? The everywhere crossbody. So it's a little smaller, but it's cream. And okay, so my only cream, like lighter one, is a Sherpa one, so I can't really use it in the summer. So like I'm obsessed with this strap. It's so cute, I'm so excited. I don't really know what these loops are for. Can somebody tell me? Don't know what those are for, but maybe like keychains, but it's super cute. Like it says, says Lululemon here, and then it has the logo here. And I don't know, it's really cute. I don't, I seriously have no clue what these loops are for, but I'm hoping that it holds a good amount. I already can see there's not a zipper on the back. 
Um, the only, okay, so there's not a zipper on the back, but there is like the little mesh inside. So super interesting. I think it's super cute. Um, I like it. I just think it's so like subtle and like cute and I feel like you could dress it up. And then this is like a good material that I feel like you could easily wipe off. So very excited about this. Drinking my coffee, but a week from today, I'm going to be at mm, finals. Literally, I'm freaked. That's so scary. I love it, but it's so scary. <laughs> but right now, I'm just enjoying my coffee, and I'm watching Rachel's new vlog. Um, this is her wedding week prep, so I'm super excited about it. And here's my iced soy vanilla latte. So good. Yum. And my nails are so cute. I'm obsessed. All right, guys. Here is today's outfit for the shower. Um, I've been loving this dress. It's from Chopo. I got it a while ago, and I've been waiting to wear it. Just is like this, and it has little cutouts. Puffy sleeves. Love it. Don't mind the shoes. We're going to set up. So I actually just... I'm gonna wear these pointed toe orange Mark Fisher block heels are actually really comfy and I just feel like they look so cute with this dress. So that's what we're gonna wear. I am gonna pack them and I feel like it's cute. So yeah, 